Well, well, well. Enjoy with me this feast right here. Wait, the tables are empty. What the f? Zero season three. This is a very hype one for me. I already made a spoiler free video, so if you haven't watched it yet, it's probably better you don't watch this video. This is going to be full spoilers. So yeah, let's not waste any time and get started. By the way, some of these stuff are going also to be in the spoiler free video so if you're gonna watch both of them there will be some repetitive stuff except there's more context i guess so yeah right off the bat beatrice yep where, where the fuck is she? this fucking thing is the best character in the anime all this character development from last season carried over to this season you start off fresh she's a different person a different character of like in every single way almost the character development is so strong in this one that I don't think I even can go back to season 1 and season 2 and rewatch them and experience the sorrow she went through. But Subaru, no, 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 yeah, Subaru is my boy. We'll torture him like every day. It's, it's all good. <laughs> oh yeah, by the way, did you like the 90 minutes episode? Like, they absolutely dropped their fucking massive cock on the table right here. And we're like, you know what? How about four episodes in one episode? Yup, that's it. Take it. That's what they did and I fucking enjoyed it. In every context you want to believe in. And of course this season has a lot of familiar faces. As you can see, this season is gonna be fucking big. I can feel it. If it wasn't already obvious by who is sitting in here, these are not even all the people <laughs> involved in this arc. So I don't know what the fuck is gonna happen. But I do know what the fuck is gonna happen. Because the cliffhanger of this episode was fucking fantastic. I think the uh, Archbishop of Wrath suddenly came in and w w was like, Ayo, child. Everyone, wow, he's so cool. Wow, amazing. Wow, started praising. Wow, until the child dropped. Still praising. Wow, dead. Yup, that whole scene was so creepy Rezero is I don't say Rezero is a masterpiece for no reason they hurt a child in an anime which is nowadays considered oh no we must not show the children getting bro just show it it's fiction no one fucking you're showing worse shit so yeah that was a very nice surprise they uh, gave us and speaking of kids, I'm starting to think that <laughs> everyone in this anime is starting to have their own portable lolly slash shota. Subaru has Beatrice, uh, Garfield right here, which by the way, just to remind you, he a actually turns into a orange cat. <laughs> yes, and he's called Garfield. So yeah, th there's only one thing left and it's eating lasagna or something. Anyway, Garfield has his own portable lolly right here. And at some point you do see a Shota, a portable Shota for someone I, f I forgot who it was. Oh yeah, the, it, it was the uh, that uh, woman w who has Reinhardt's father or something. Yeah, she has a portable Shota, I guess. Also, these two people, the, uh, the musician and that one dude who is obsessed with her and with TNT, Apparently, he is kinda his portable lolly too. So, uh, what's the deal? Is this the new meta in Zero? Someone having like their own portable lolly, like a, like a Pokemon or something. Like, is Beatrice the, po the Pikachu of uh, Subaru or something? Because I, I kinda see it, I kinda see it. I, I see the vision. Anyway, I absolutely enjoyed the episode and Zero once again proves who's at the top of Isekai. And I will stand by that statement. So yeah, see you again, uh, hopefully next week when something really wild happens. And yep, that's about it. Get the fuck out.